So, welcome to another episode of Fates the Night, the visual novel. And, um, yeah, L last episode, we had things going on, and um, we got to know that uh, Archer is dead. Which is really sad, actually. And that bastard, still without a noble fat, has managed to kill Heracles six times? How does he do that? Considering that uh, the god hand uh, that Heracles had, that pretty much needs to be... He needs to be killed by someone equal, like, noble fat, as, and it needs to be different ones. So, th yes, that is insane fucking impressive, but... Man. I don't know why, but I was forced to leave the ruin. Tosica pushed me out saying that girls have adjustments afterward. Changing and all that. Oh, really? I grumble, leaning against the wall. It sounds like an excuse because it is. Remembering, I frantically shake off my worldly desires. No more desires! I have to forget about it now. I won't survive if I'm submerged in memories of Saber, and more than anything, it's impolite to Saber. After all, I made contact with Saber to save her, so I shouldn't have any other emotions for Saber. <laughs> Making lots of sound for that. I'm a big liar. I can't dece deceive myself about it with excuses like that. I can't forget the spectacle I saw inside Saber, but I have to forget about it for now. Jeez, it's not no time to worry about such things. No shit, dude. What else to worry about? What should we do? What should we be worrying about right now is how to take on Berserker. So that, I can't do it alone. I thought that the last time you said that, right? I remember Archer's back. I could never like him, but all of his words have stuck in my head. I stare at the tree branch. There are only a few things I can do. Even if it's much right now, I can only do them to the best of my abilities. I pluck a handy branch. And I also find a few more branches that are straight. Well, I do like the gay branches a bit more, I'm just saying. Are you coming? Running in there with his branches. I hear Tosika's voice. I return to the room carrying the branches I found. Well, the only problem is whether I'm able to act normal of seeing into Saber's heart even for a moment. I guess such words were only on my part. Saber's acting resolutely as always. She must have completely accepted the incident, unlike me. Damn, I won't lose. Well, turning this comp the competition might be a good thing, I guess. It's stupid to be only one blushing, so I try my best to act calm. Saber and I nod. まともな方法じゃバーサーカーとは勝負にならない。勝つためには奇襲。仕掛けたのなら反撃させずに一撃で首を落とすのが絶対条件だと思う。But killing me in one blow is impossible, right? 同感です。バーサーカーと打ち合ったところで、あれには致命傷を与えられません。倒すのならば、打ち合いの外から決すべきでしょう。打ち合いの外からって。バーサーカーが俺たちに気づく前に先回りして襲うってことか。そりゃ、あいつと正面から戦うのは無謀だけど、そっちの方はもっと無謀だ。あいつが奇襲なんてさせる玉か。I guess the only way it would be now when he's still trying to like regenerate, but he still have like a bunch of lives left. How are you supposed to do this? バーサーカーに気づかれずに近寄る。I don't think I can imagine it's to take out Ilya. 
あっちにはイリアスイールがいるんだもの少なくともセイバーとシローの気配は簡単に感知されるわ私は気配を隠せるから大丈夫だけどまあふん I don't know how it works, but Ilya can feel Saber and my presence, huh? If Torsaka is the only one who can hide, then. Masaka, Kishu o Suru no a Torsaka that the Unja Nida Roma. Tosen de Show? Ichiban in Nerawa Teru no a Shiro Nandashi. Kononaka de Ichiban Wokia Sui no a Matashidamono. Skio Tsuite, Shiro Kara Bassari Aru no a Makasana Sai. Not the need of. What? She gonna Oh god damn. That would work. そうか、バサリって。バサカがそんな甘いわけないだろう。それはそうよ。だからセイバーに隙を作ってもらうの。セイバー、体はどのくらい回復したうん、まあ、well。通常戦闘ならば問題はありません。ですが、防具の使用は
there's a high probability that would ha that would happen again. So I should stay away from the bad field. But I would have no intention of doing that, even if she didn't tell me to be there. I understand. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, were my words that surprising? <laughs> yeah, for rocks at first. <laughs> Saying that, I hold up the branches I just collected. My mighty weapons! Branch of the, the stick of truth, the stick of destruction. The length is perfect. The flexibility is good as well. Arr. This is the first time I've done this kind of strengthening. <laughs> Sorry. But I don't think there's any flaw in the principle. The point is, I just need to keep reinforcing it until it becomes a real one. And for this, I also have a reference which he had one too. On top of that, magical energy has been flowing in my body for a while now. I just have to repeat the usual process now. I analyze the basic structure and I modify it. I analyze the composition materials and reinforce them. But that is not enough for the original is a branch and the finished product is his bow. I have to imagine it from the concept of creation. If I am to get this if close enough to read one, I have to formulate every hypothesis at least in my head. I open my eyes. The branch is shaped right, but... Mm, it's ugly and crooked, but I know it will work as a bow. I just have to make the arrows in the same way. Shiro, are you gonna use magic あるよ。You're really gonna sneak and be hiding up in a tree? で、セイバーがなんとかバーサーカーに隙を作ったら四角であるいや。yeah. Yeah. Saying that, Tosaka takes a jewel out of her pocket. Sono Hosekiwa? But as she got monogoro tsuita to Kikara, Tameni Tameta Chokin Mita in a monoyo. Korehitots de A Hante no Daimajutsu, Sokuzani has say Saseraleru. Juko at Tandakedone. Ah, got them. Soka. あの時の魔術ならば確かにバーサーカーは防げない。オッケー、それが Tosika sticks out her chest in confidence. <laughs> but it's not much of a chest, no. なんか半端に成功くないか、お前。同感です。私が言えることではありませんが、せめて半分使い切るくらいの気前の良さが必要だと思うのですが。うん、何よ。そんなの人の勝手でしょ。私がどれほど苦労してここまで貯めたって思ってるのよ。Well, still though, I mean, is it not the? Oh God, damn. I'm getting headache. Saber Ryan protests silently. 
silent protest. Tosca lives depend on this as well, so it won't be funny if she gets stingy and we end up failing because of that. Yeah, that would be. I mean, it's it's a life. It, it's been oh, just for everyone. <laughs> とにかく作戦はそれだけよ。あとは私が隠れられて、シロがセーバーの援護をしやすい場所を探さなくちゃ。イリアスフィールが来る前にいい場所を見つけましょう。The thing is, I don't think that would it won't be that easy. Sad. Yeah, we can't stay in this room now. As Tosca says, all that is left is to find a spot to Oh my god damn it camera. Why is my shit going breaking down? Why does it do that? What are you doing, cat? Uh, ah, spot to wait for Berserk, but before that... <laughs> Choices! Does it affect anything? Does it... Uh, I guess I'm gonna be worried about Saber. I wonder if Saber is real or right. She says she will have no problem fighting, but isn't it hard on her fighting Berserk when she was so weak before? No, I'm worried about her noble phantasm. <laughs> Saber said that. That means that Saber will disappear the instant she used that sword. Saber. Saber. Hi. What did you say, Shiro? Ah. Before fighting, you should make a promise to me. Go all bangers on Berserker. Eh. If I can do that, I won't be afraid. Hmm. 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 あの本具は使わないでほしいんだ。地上であんなものを使ったら大ごとだし、それにバーサーカーを倒せてもセイバーが死ぬなんていうのは嫌だ。But then, I mean, if you don't use it in a situation when it maybe must be used, and she vanishes because of it, but she takes out Berserker, or she don't use it and everyone else is dead anyways. That is obvious, I see it, I like. I mean, obviously, if they can defeat him without using it, of course, that would be the best, but... Yes, I understand. I don't have any power to use the power of Hogu. I can't use the power of Hogu. I can't use the yeah, that is that is also good. But the thing I am still worried about is like there are still so many servants and masters out there that we have, and they oh gosh, all about to defeat Berserk. Saber declares so. That makes me happy. Yes, it's mono Saber da. Unzari suru hodo reise de anshin shita. Hmm. So re wa dou yu imi de shou ka, Shiro. Uh oh. Tai wa nai yo. Ii kara soto ni deyo. トウサカをまたせるとまた文句を言われるからな。デミトウサカ。そうですね。リンはシロに文句を言うのが趣味のようですから。まあ、そう、ハビ。Saying <笑> Oh my. Hey, Saber's blushing awkwardly. What about that? Saber, what happened? Did you have anything else? No, I don't have to do that. But... Saber blushes even more. Her figure looks like me from earlier. Oh, <laughs> I blush too. Her hand is my in mine, I vividly recall Saber's sensation and pull away quickly. My Rin, you need to get in here because stop are getting awkward. Unable to say anything, we are stand there. Oh so so it'd be. So this <laughs> is We start to go with that. We start to go with that false conversation. Once we go outside, we won't return here. I look back at the room for the last time, 
and I head to the battlefield, suppressing my beating heart. <sighs> Man, I have a bad, I, I have a bad feeling about this. And... Man, it looks like it's fall, you know? So would it actually be good to hide in a tree when... Uh, I guess most leaves have been falling down, you know? Or I, it looks like there are leaves on trees, of course, but... We reach an open clearing in the forest. The sun is rising and the forest is darkened by the morning mist. Compared to the inside of the dense forest, this place has an open view. Tosaka, this is not She's, she's, she's such a perfectionist, considering even the escape routes. I call that, you know, a plan so not everyone dies. I think it would be a good thing. Tosca rent us to the forest. I first time heard that word before. But Saber stares into the distance and doesn't move. Saber? I guess it's too late. Uh oh. I feel a shill. We are screwed. I can't forget it since I felt it once already. I can't even see him nor feel his presence. But this pressure on my body must be because of him. Narni, what the hell? That was creepy. A girl's voice echoes through the f That is some demented nightmare fuel right there. What the hell? Beyond the mist, from inside the forest far away, something black comes straight for us. How about no? Is it because we are in a clearing under the open sky? I feel like Ilya is talking to us while looking down from the sky. Did you have a Shiro GPS, man? I'm not relaxed, I'm panicking here. Hold on, I'll tap down. Tosaka takes my hand, but we won't make it. Yeah, this is the final stand. Three people fighting together is not enough. Tosaka is Tosaka is not けど、危険なのはみんな一緒だ。それに、こうなっちゃ逃げ道なんかないんじゃないのか。それはそうだけど。セイバーもいいな。ここでバーサーカーを迎え撃つ。セイブ<笑> She must have agreed as she disappears into the fog. Once she goes into action, she is super fast. She gets away from the clearing and goes up in a tree in the forest. I am so worried about this. I mean, they, don't, they only focus on, on Berserker and obviously that is reasonable, but... Iliasville is a pretty fucking strong Magus as well. I mean, however they... Oh, god damn it. The fog flickers. Flicker punch. From the morning fog, as if a black darkness seeping out, the mad warrior appears along with a white girl. <laughs> それとも、もう関連したの、お兄ちゃん? 
I prefer Ilya in Fate Kalade, I'm just saying. Why she doesn't try to kill you? There's about 40 meters between us and Ilya. We were facing each other on opposite ends of the clearing. Thank you, I guess. Hello after echoes through the forest. Does it irritate her? Saber standing beside me is so worked up that she could attack at any moment. You really think I would beg for my life to spare me? Please don't kill me! I'm too young to die! I probably would end up crying. Tosiga must have finished climbing the tree. If you're going to place herself, it will be near the scent of the clearing. Nobody will notice if she was, was right where the branches are overlapping, and it should be strong enough to support her as well. So, she knows Rin is here. If she says and I gotta say, it's a big squirrel. No, it's no Rin. It's just a big squirrel in the trees. I guess they're what you expect from Berserker's master. She has a complete understanding of what can be overlooked and what can't be. そうか。セイバーを連れてる城は足手まといだものね。リン一人ならもっと遠くに逃げられる。そういうことだ。もうとっくに森を出てるだろう。今から追ってもアインズベルンの結界よ。誰が入ってきて誰が出て行ったかぐらいはわかるんだから。あれから外に出た人間は一人もいない。ビンはまだ森にいるわ。探し出すのはこの後でも十分よ。That is not good. Snap. Thank God. If Ilya can only sense the boundaries of the forest, she doesn't know about Tosuke. Okay, that is good at least. Uh, they only, as I said, she knows when they go and leave, but not where they are, so that is good at least. That would have been sucking bad. <laughs> Actually, she completely believed what I said. Ilya is certainly a cold hardened master. But still, can't that cold hardness still be recovered? Ilya, Master, こんな戦いをやめることはできないのか。できないよ。she has a little hope in her voice. But as long as Saber is beside me, I can't nod to her words. Yay! As he glares over while looking at Alien Berserker. In that instant, we got fucked. The air in the clearing freezes. So, Nara, Honki de Korostager. So no more Yagari to Ishoni. Konagona ni kudai tagerua, Shiro. Fuck? What? Is that. What? What is that? What? I don't know! A panda is appearing on her face. No, it's not just her face. The thing is, all her. It's a juke. I. What? How? Command spells? 
遊びは終わりよ蹴散らしなさいヘラクレス Why does she have so many command spells? It doesn't make sense. A dead voice. As if to answer it, the giant behind the roar. Roar! Okay, that was better than I did. A scream that shakes the earth. The giant scream has been going insane, and as every build increases, it forms and swells. So, now, I'm going to be able to get the money to get the money to get the money. Oh. It's unnatural for Sable to feel a shudder. No shit! Even I, unable to tell how strong a warrior is, can sense that this is not to be messed with. I hope he doesn't kill her. That, that, that would be messed up. <laughs> Fucking damn. It's an explosive roar. It roars out, not even a howl now, and the giant jumps in. <coughs> Final Fantasy music cued! A silver light dashes forward in reply. Berserker lands in the center of the clearing. His huge body descends and Sabre runs straight for its landing point. The ground trembles. As if stopping a meteor, Sabre attacks Berserker. Man, this is so cool. Damn, this is like, fucking cool. It's the return of legends. In this forest filled with the morning mist, two shadows clash without ceasing. Bursting is just overwhelming. If his horizontal blow is a whirlwind, his descending blow is a waterfall. If Saber takes such an attack, it will prove fatal even for her. Saber repels such attacks straight on without faltering. Against storm-like blows, she deflects them with all her might. If she doesn't, she will be slashed in half along with her sword. The infinite blows that continues without pause are in fact a blow diverted with all her might. The continuous sound of clashing. The, range, the ranges are different. The speeds are different. The strength remains, remaining are too different. The only thing possible for Saber is to smash her sword into the unav unavoidable attack and stop it from slashing her by offsetting, offsetting it with her own blow. To speak metaphorically, Berserk is a broken rock drill. The blade spinning all directions will mercilessly destroy all that approaches. You won't reach out even a little, that's it. One would get entangled in the blade and be shredded into pieces, unable to even run away. A normal human can't go up against such a thing. If approaching it, it is fatal, you can only run away. But Saber places her, herself within her blades and does not retreat. Man, I can speak. So she will be cut down bit by bit. The sword makes sparks and it's all natural for her arm to splinter bit by bit. She is constantly putting herself in fatal situation. I just hold my breath. In ancient times, the heroes that went up against Dragon must all have been like her. They know well enough that their strengths are different. But still, they bet on the chance of a lifetime. A great violence surpassing human. They defend until the only opening appears. And many warriors died when no such miracle occurred. Their fight is just that. A dazzling battle that takes my eyes away, but it has only an end prepared with it being saved to feed as she is hurt more by the second. The roar shakes the ground. Berserker whirlwind cuts through the wind and flings back the defending saber. Saber's armor ships away with every blow, and as she, she hits the ground, she shot bravely at Berserker without falling to her knees. But she is already at her limits. Saber breathing wildly, and her movements are slowing down even to my eyes. She's not even trying to create an opening in Berserker. Saber will be slashed by in a few more blows. In my clenched fist is a bow. 
I... What's the point? Shit! Okay, we, we, I'm gonna save. That is so depressing. I promote better backup, as I was promising to do. And what's the point, man? I don't know. We gotta. The instant saber is flung away. A fire at Berserker. This won't hurt him, but it should at least take his attention of saber. Arrow that hit Bursting Temple does nothing. I can't even get his attention. Oh my fucking god. The giant does not block. No, he doesn't even care about my attack. Yay! Ilya loves echoes through the forest. I can't do anything. Save is about to collapse in front of me and I can't do anything. I'm too weak. I can't hurt Berserker no matter what I do. All I'm doing is distracting Saber. Yeah. A strong blow. Saber repelling that attack as her feet drive driven into the ground up her trying ankle. Man. The blows are heavy and fast. The axe sword flying above Saber's head comes down. The sword shaves off some of her armor as she flings herself away and breaks the ground. I feel like I grind my teeth down. I'm unable to do anything at all. Can't I protect Saber nor fight it alongside her? There's nothing I can do. All I can do is. Naraba, simete imeji shiro. Omae ni dekiru koto nado. That guy said so. That's right. What was he saying? It wasn't usual his usual harassment. Those were her held an important importance that I need to understand right now. Now saying that. Weren't all of his words a warning that I shouldn't have ignored? Saber body flung away. She didn't jump to get away. She took the blow. That storm-like blow landed right on her side. Oh. Saber totters. Concentrating strength into her numb fingers, she faces Berserk again, coughing violently. The giant will not miss the opening Saber has finally shown. <coughs> My voice won't reach them. It's useless for me to say anything, and it's useless for me to have a bow mimicking Archer. Do I still not understand? What can I do? What should I be doing? That's right. What do I need in order to save Saber? I don't know. Beatbox. A bow won't do. Even a lance won't be able to pierce him. And that doesn't mean I should have the same weapon as the enemy. That giant. To defeat that mountain, I'll need a sword. A sharp and gorgeous sword of the king that will defeat the enemy in one blow. Like that golden sword she's so suited to her that I saw in my dreams. My head hurts. Bearing my nausea, I still stare at Saber. But ironically, I feel like I'm going crazier the more I stare at her about to co about to collapse. What? Save and bursting movement seem to be in a slow motion. Many switches are arranged, are arranged in a row. Coughing, Saber bends her body in pain for an instant. Berserk smashed down his axe sword with all his might. As if making a line, the firing hammers move into position one by one. He seems like knocking down dominoes. The triggers are pulled all at once. <laughs> Bursting blow smashes Saber away. It's fatal. Saber body split through the waist and her piece.
Okay. I mean, what? The only thing flying into the air is Saber's armor. Berserk only smashes Saber's armor. Saber creates an opening to make Berserk take a large swing. And Saber shows in the top speed using all the energy she has left. A black howl surges out. But he can't retreat from Saber, who's right in front of him. She plays both hands on her sword and slashes at Berserk with all her might. I can't believe it. The giant that seemed to be rooted on the ground is smacked back a few meters by Saber's blow. And then... The true final attack is executed instantly. She must intend to fire from as close as possible. Tosuke jumps down from the branch and high above and throws her jewels as she, as she descends. That sounds fancy! The rain of ice whirls down. In it, three giant icicles shaped like spears have enough magical energy concentrated in them to blow away a whole mansion. Damn! Ilya, who was only watching until now, screams. She must have realized how dangerous that attack is, but it's too late. The spear of ice isn't fail falling, it's just fall. As it's fire, it accelerates to skewer Berserk. There's no way he will be able to dodge it. But once in a lifetime opportunity, a shotgun of ice perfectly coordinated with Saber's desperate attack. It has more than enough magical energy in it to be able to kill Berserker. But... He swings his axe through the air. Even as he pushed back by Saber, he destroyed the three blocks of ice with his quickly redded axe sword. Damn. Splashes of blood. Perhaps because he swung with only one arm, the ice is not completely destroyed and it's lacerated his arm. Not only that, the ice will freeze on the giant's arm and stop its movement completely. But still, it only got one of his arms. <sighs> Saber raises her voice. It's only natural, because Berserk's other arm has grabbed Tosca. Uh oh, no 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 no. Tosca fate contorts in pain. With Berserk's power, it should be no problem to crush Tosca. Tosca! I run. I don't care if I'm only dragging her down. I don't care if I can't do anything. I won't let him crush Tosca. Say must not have any power left to stand, but she still lifts, up, lifts her body. Tosca must be in pain as she reaches out with her face downcast. <laughs> She smiles and speaks boldly. <laughs> Everyone gasps. Saber, I, and even Berserk must be fro must have frozen. She is horrible. She knew this was going to happen, yet to never told anyone told us about it. Berserk puts power into his grip. But it's a second too late. <laughs> Bullets or lights are fired. Four jewels are used. The rapid fire from perfect point blank range kills the black mad warrior for sure this time. No. It has splendid perfectly blown away his life. Did Berserk heads get blown off? Blood spatter over over me and I'm lost 10 meters away. Holy damn! Is this his spinal fluid? How do you know that? And why do you wonder about it? I can't be too happy about it, but when there's a thing other than blood mixed in it. What? But I'm sure it wasn't... But I'm sure it wasn't overkill. He was a monster. I bet Torsica would have been crushed if she, he didn't, she didn't blow off his head in a single blow. <sighs> I slow my running steps. Tosca is still held by Berserk, but the battle is over. 
Berserker face is still covered in what do 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 do. If it's so, if it's something I know with Berserker, especially this one, it's never over. From the smoldering sound, it must have been a huge explosion. Uso. I hear Tosaka's voice. She is looking through white smoke, dumbfounded. Hold on. Is it just my imagination? Bursa thing is holding Tosca digging deeper into her. Tosca just staring at the white smoke. But it doesn't last long. The large cloud of white smoke fades away. In it. It's Berserker's face, though it was certainly blown away. Oh. Tosuke had lost the words, covered by the demonic stare. Laugh, the echoes through the clearing. The silver master controlling Berserk from the edge of the clearing is laughing. <laughs> So he had died seven times now? That means that uh, we need to kill him five times more. Rin, do we have more crystals? Hmm. She must have figured out something important from Ilya's words. Tosuke's eyes are strained in faint regret. そうか。神明が分かった時点で思い当たるべきだった。ヘラクレスって言ったらヒドラの弓なのに持ってるのはただの岩だった。だからこいつの宝具はものじゃないんだ。英雄ヘラクレスのシンボルはその。そう。肉
to me! I smack my bow again. What is up with archers being melee in this uh, in faith in general? The giant does not budge. He must think of nothing of me at all. My fingers are numb. What kind of body does he have? If I the one thing of the hit the, the one doing the hitting have my hands going numb. Huh? I raise my face at Saber's voice. In that instant, a butterfly flies through the air like a leaf. Ouch. I drop like a piece of trash. Berserk smacked me with a frozen sword. The bow instantly blocked with it is easily smashed and I'm thrown so far. I've writhed in pain. The breaking sound was not from the bow. One of my arms is bent like a spire's. Fuck! This is messed up. Breathing her so much that I want to smash my my lungs. Uh, what? Uh, I have probably a bunch of broken ribs there. I can't breathe right from the blood coming up my throat, but it doesn't matter. Breathing will just make me pass out. I shouldn't be breathing right now. You do pass out if you don't breathe. I'm just saying. I get up. Right now, I have to... I run. It's my turn this time. I'll break his arm and save to... How? You don't summon a, a super sword, of course. He must have eyes on the back of his head as he swings his sword as he, as he flinging away a bug. I can dodge it. I won't be hit by something swung with a frozen arm. I, that gives me doubts. Damn, my body's sinking. It must have scraped my leg. Damn it. Don't break my leg when I'm, you haven't even hit it. I can't do that. I won't let Tosaka die. What do I need to save her? A weapon. A blade would be good. At my feet are the remaining of the destroyed bow. Above me is Berserk like sword coming down. I pick up a broken piece. Descending sword. There's no time to think. I channel my magic energy into it. I easily succeed at strengthening it. But the sword comes down. The broken piece is totally smashed this time. My body that should have dodged the blow collapses. So there was nothing, no meaning in strengthening such a broken piece. If I am to do it again, I have to do it from the very beginning. Nothing should be impossible. If there's a model, anyone can imitate it. So I have to repeat the foundation, composition, work, experience, time, and... Roar? The giant turns. It must have decided to kill this annoying nuisance before Tosaka. Raising my body, I glare at the giant. I have no fear, my mind has already burned up. But behind me... Prepared even for her own el elimination, Saber is determined to use her holy sword. Uh, is that the only... Ah man, what am I supposed to do? Okay, don't use it. Yes! The wine unravels. I start to see the golden sword in Saber's hands. The one that mu not, must not be used. The sword I told her not to use and under any circumstances. I snap. It makes the last rope holding me snap. I don't think I should have done that. Actually, I think that's a very bad thing. One of the command spells disappears. I don't know. I don't know anything about that. All I know is that you'll disappear if you use that. I won't allow that. And I can't forgive myself for not being able to let her use it so freely and for not being able to save Tosik and myself. Sabe falls to her knees. Just releasing the sword gets her like that. You can't use that sword in your condition. 
So wait. If you can't use that sword, I make one that you can use. Alright, I gotta beat the rockets in my mind. Alright. With that said, it's obvious. That's the only thing I can do. So make it. Make something that will not lose to anything. Always imagine the strongest. Imagine the best imitation that will deceive everybody, even yourself. It's not difficult at all. It's not impossible. From the beginning, this body was... A magic circuit special for this purpose alone. I spring up. My whole body is burning and my left hand feels like it's on fire. Haha, <laughs> I cover you! Shouting gun! Same voice is filled with a blank amazement. She is staring at what I'm holding with such which should not exist here. Does the sword have a will of its own? Does it scream even louder? The golden sword does not stop and is pulled toward it, slash through the giant's arm. Tossing a force with the arm that was grabbing her, and a sword that cut through his arm shattered like glass. All the blood in me regurgitate, regurg but there's no problem there. The sword broke. That is impossible. If I imitated that sword, it cannot be broken. It broke because it was not suffi sufficient. My image of it fell short of the real sword. Snap. His eye stares at me. The giant sword is swung to really kill me this time. I don't care about that. He's not my opponent. For me, a Shiro, there's only one opponent. The sword was just not, what now wasn't perfect. The unbreakable sword that broke because there was a flaw in the assumptions. If I am to duplicate it, I can only duplicate its shape. I must also reproduce the maker. I hear a gasp. In front of me is the axle swung like a storm and defending the sword that is being made. I don't know if I'm desperate, but I'm blocking the attack with the sword in my hand. But that is none of my business. What I need to do now is make this real. That is a mistake as well. And what mistake that is, I don't know, but we will see that for next episode. So thank you for watching. See you later on. Have a continue super great day. And it's getting excited.